All right. Hey, Evolution family, welcome. All right, it's Wednesday, April 10th, 2019, a little bit after 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I'm Jose Lambert of Archer Travel Service, and we are broadcasting live from the Archer Travel main corporate headquarters in beautiful Accra Center, California. And I want to welcome you to the Evolution Travel Cafe training session that we have every Wednesday. So, hey, how's it going out there? Um, um, today we're going to cover how to prepare your client for travel. Now, and the reason why we're bringing this up, it's getting to be summertime, and I'm already, the last couple of weeks what we've been getting, especially this week, is we've been getting the last minute, you know, Easter bookings, and you know, we want to go to Orlando for Easter, and you know, for spring break, and a lot of the inventory has sold out already, so we, you're going to start getting busier, and that means you're going to, your pipeline's going to get jammed up and you're going to have to start preparing your clients to how to travel properly because what you're doing this when you're doing this what you're doing is you're building value in your business and you're building trust with your client all right and they're saying, wow they're showing me how to do all this because remember look you're only going to go to Europe once or twice in your life you're only going to go to Asia once or twice in your life do it correctly really know how to show them how to do you know um, pack and luggage and, and, and suitcases and how to do all that but we're, we're going to get to all that okay um, these training sessions and also I'm sorry I need to go back here since the beginning of the year we've been talking about the process and the steps of the process so we've talked about how to qualify how to build trust how to fill out the credit card authorization form how to do follow-up okay so now in this step you've already sold you know the cruise or the all-inclusive and now you're going to prepare your clients for travel all right so that's what we're going to cover today. But first, a big shout out to all the evolution agents that arrive early. And let's see here. Do, 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 do. Let me see. Uh, as I go up, hold on. Where's this mouse here? What's the matter, Jose? Can't even work the mouse. Okay. So starting with Tanisha Williams, Rita Flow uh, Fowler, uh, Andrea Livermore. Hey, how's it going? Uh, Loris X Bro Brock, Lorez Brock, Denise Doe. Uh, who else? Joe Schofield. Hey, Joe. Hey, how you doing, Joe? You know, call me up. Let me find out what's going on with the, all that cruise and stuff. Joe's a, like a cruise specialist. Uh, let's see. Donna. Donna Ferrario. Uh, Kitty Jean. Amy Farrell. Keta Jones. Alicia Gray. Uh, Kathy Shutpin. Don Shutpin. Eileen uh, Earhart. Hi, Eileen. How are you? Uh, Diamond Rees. Amanda Price. Nina M, Nina Mitchell, Aloha, Aloha, Nina, God bless you, God bless you, Nina. Um, Mayor, uh, Myra Graham, I'll do two more. Um, Katie Kemp, hi, Kate. Uh, Nicole Harris, Ebony Little, Gina DeMassey. Hi, Gina, how are you? Our sandals expert, that's her, Gina DeMassey. And uh, let's see who else. And Melinda Ann Urbina and Gina Remus. And I'll do a Zambia, Zambia Everett, the lady who books New York group. Her group's going to New York. She's got like 100 rooms in Manhattan. All right, so that's all good. All right, so, um, all right, uh, please review and tell your new agents. Okay, these training sessions, they happen every Wednesday. And they are for new evolution agents, returning agents, uplines. Last week, we covered my profit agility. Try to say that three times. My profit agility, my profit, ag okay. Uh, which is the replacement for Advantage Direct. A lot of important information was covered, so please inform your new agents uh, about that, that webinar and that it's featured in the Evolution Travel Cafe and also in your, um, and on this Facebook page of the Evolution Travel Cafe. So tell your new agents all about that. The format of these training sessions is meant to be informative and responsive, so always have paper and pen ready to take down notes. If you can't make it to the training sessions, you can review them here on this Facebook page or you can review them in the training sessions of your travel cafe, your evolution travel cafe, under webinars and training videos. All right, so here's the format for today's session. We're going to have some news and announcements. Like I said today, I will show you and review how to prepare your client for travel. Then a visit to some places around the world, a little surprise. Then after that, we'll take some questions from evolution agents, any topic, your, your website, whatever's going on. If I don't know the answer, I will forward it to the proper departments, and then I'll get back to you. But first things first. First, contact information. Contact us. 818-248-1511. Again, that's our main line, 818-248-1511. Our phone number has stayed the same. Um, if you ever need anything, help, questions, air tickets, cruises, 
vacation help with travel, bookings, or if you have questions in regards to anything travel issue related, please don't hesitate to contact us here at Art to Travel. Our offices are open Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 5 p.m., and Saturdays from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m., and I'm usually here on Saturdays, so you can call me. And we're here to help and assist you in any way for help or questions. Hey, and I'm serious about this. We, we get too many calls with the new agents going, well, I've been in the program about three weeks, and I've been working on this booking for two and a half weeks. Why didn't you call us? If you don't know, the, the only way that you can be successful in this business is get the booking done and completed, move on to the next booking. If you're stuck on a cruise booking and you've been working it all week, call us. We can help you. We can help you get it done and finished so you can go to the next booking and make more commission. Okay? That's good. Um, my direct phone line is 818-236-4260. Again, the number is 818-236-4260. Um, my email address is josel, that's J-O-S-E-L, at archertravel.com. J-O-S-E-L at archertravel.com. And the office hours are Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. plus Saturday, 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Notes from the staff from Jill Langley. Atlanta is still open. So if you want to go, you contact Jill Langley via email only. Do not call. I'm going to repeat this again. If you want to go to Atlanta, you send Jill Langley an email only. Do not call. And the, her email address is jlangley at archertravel.com. That's jlangley at archertravel.com. And here are the dates. The dates are April 20th, which is like next weekend. Um, Holiday Inn Suites, North Atlanta Airport, and it's from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. And they're going to, Carnival's going to be there, Expedia Tap, I think Vax, um, and Ms. Jill Langley's going to be there. So that's that. So it's still open. If you want to go, and, and, I, and I think it's free, isn't it? It's free, free, right? Yeah, it's free. So if it's free, you want to go, it, it's a Sunday event, go to it. It's going to be great. Okay, notes from Yolanda. I don't know. We, we, I've been saying this the last several weeks. And Yolanda's like, Jose, they're not getting it. Please, please, please do not call the airlines for group air. We've told you this the last several weeks, and we're still getting calls from the airlines going, one of your evolution agents book, you know, called American Airlines to book 85 seats to go to Punta Cana. And we're like, what? So don't call the airlines. If you have group air only, you contact Archer Travel. We have a whole travel desk for that, okay? Um, and something really weird is happening too. Attention new agents, when you go to websites and register, use your evolution email address. For some reason, there's a bunch of new agents using the using the you know, the registering with the supplier when the supplier asks for an email you guys are putting down evo supplier help at archertravel.com so when those emails come in we're going huh why are we getting notifications from vax that someone registered under this okay so just just use your email your regular email address don't use any archer email addresses when you're registering okay um notes from dave if you're coming back and you've been away from the program three to six months Please review the webinars and the PTA training link in your Evolution back office because we're changing stuff all the time. All right, so uh, first let's go to the Travel Cafe. Boom, 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 boom. Here we are in the Travel Cafe. All right, then we scroll up, please. All right, okay, so let's stop right here. Okay, we have, these, these promotional videos are going great. Um, Mr. Perkins and uh, Jessica Parsons have been really pumping these out, and that's great. Um, here's the thing, though, that we've gotten from a note. When you purchase these, we send them back to you, and you have seven days to download them to your computer. After seven days, the video disappears, and then you're like, where is it? How come I don't have it? Because you didn't download it. So as soon as you get it, all right, and you get the email verification going, here it is, download it to your computer, and that way you can start emailing it. Don't wait around going, oh, wow, I'm thinking I'm going to wait for a week and then see if it's in there. Because then you got to call us back or email us back going, I lost my video. I don't know what to do and I need to get it back. All right? So make sure you do that. All right, download that. Okay, to the right, as you can see, we have a sales expo happening on April 11th. Um, that's for the uh, Travel Leaders Sales Expo in Milwaukee. Uh, Ron's call is happening. We're going to be having a lot more events coming up. So, yeah, look at that. Check that out. All right. Um, okay, and the marketing videos are going great. So let's scroll down a little bit more. There's the uh, Jose Wednesday call. There's Ron's uh, Q&A. 
and I want to just stop here for a moment. Really, you should be, uh, I'm telling you, we are in here because we're so busy in this office, but uh, on Tuesday morning, I have to come back in here and, and I watch Ron's Q&A because that's why I find out what's happening because we are so busy between his, his travel and stuff and what we're doing in the office. But if you ever want to know about what's happening with the company, the new promotions that we're doing, the new ideas in marketing that we're coming up with, you know, there he's the man. You can ask him anything you want. He'll answer all your questions. If he doesn't know the answers, he'll refer them to either Jill Langley or myself, and we'll get those answers to you as quickly as possible. But really check that out. It's every Monday, uh, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. All right? So that's Ron. And then on the left-hand uh, left side, what we have is the top earners quarterly. We've got that list going on. And then let's scroll up a little bit more. Uh, stop right there. Okay, to the right here, this is the featured webinar, Archer Travel Profit Agility. This is what replaces Advantage Direct. I, we, we talked about this last week. You should be watching this. So if you know of anyone that's, that's coming into the program and wants to do that Advantage Direct or you know, prop, My Profit Agility, there is the webinar. We're going to keep that there for a while because it's new, and I want you guys to be really familiarize yourself with it. Okay, so let's keep going. Uh, up, please. Okay. Uh, there's a note about the personalized Evo marketing. Keep going up. And stop right there. Whoop. Okay. Uh, right there. On the right, these are the business card requirements. This is very important for all you new agents. This is the information that we would like to have you put down on your business cards. So there it is. Please put that information on your business cards so you have that. And then we have the Evo marketing newsletter which we talked about last week. Scroll up, please. Um, and wait, 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 some more, and some more, and some more. Land Alive, keep going, keep going. Where is the, there's that, there's that, there's that. Okay, so now let's go to the um, Evolution back office. See you guys, you should be touching the, the Travel Cafe, the back office several times during the day because you'll always find new uh, announcements and new information in there. Okay, so we're now in the back office. We're talking about the pay card, and then as we scroll up, okay, um, hold up right here, okay, um, this, the Evolution Convention, um, really important, really, 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 really important that, that, you know, you guys go to this, it's going to be great. To my understanding, we've gotten more suppliers, I'm not supposed to mention who they are, but we've got some really good suppliers, we're going to have a travel expo right next to the convention. So as you guys come out for breaks and stuff, you'll be able to meet new BDMs, new suppliers, everything. It's going to be great. Um, I will be there. Jill Langley will be there. A bunch of staff, of uh, Archer Travel staff will be there. And, of course, you know, the Evolution staff will be there. So it's going to be a fun time. We always have a really good time. So highly recommend. Now, look, it's 249 right now. And to my understanding, at the end of this month or even sooner, that price is going to go up. So really get yourself, uh, you know, make sure you get registered with that. Because tickets are going to go fast, and, and um, it's going to be a really good time. It's going to be fun. All right, so now with that, let us now go to these slides. Ba -ba -ba -ba. All right. We're talking about, we're going to review this, okay? The Archer Travel Credit Card Authorization Review. Um, Ms. Langley suggested that we review this again because we're getting a lot of confusion from you guys, so I want to just touch on this. Okay, so let's talk about this first one. For VAX only in Mark Travel, when you're booking in Blue Sky Tours, Southwest Airlines Vacations, American Airlines Vacations, United Airlines Vacations, FunJet, TNT Vacations, all of those, okay? For anything with VAX Vacation Access, Mark Travel, the form is in the Travel Cafe. You go in to forms, fill out the form, you go in there, and what we need on the form is this. The last four numbers of the credit card number to be used, all the information on the form needs to be filled out, which is address, phone number, everything, security code, expiration date, copy of driver's license, and then you email that, all that information to credit card forms at archertravel.com. Credit card forms at archertravel.com. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay. Important reminder, all new VAX bookings, reservations, if request is less than 14 days of travel. Wait, what happened? I said, I missed <laughs> she, She's clicking around here and I can't. <laughs> uh, so, uh, 14 days of travel must phone into Archer Travel. So in other words, if you've got a client who calls you up out of nowhere and goes, I need to be in Punta Cana next week, 
You have to phone that booking reservation into Archer Travel. You will still get your commission. Don't worry about it. But anything with two weeks out notice, you have to, you have to let us know about it. So please, Upline, tell your, your new agents about this, okay? Uh, if the client is outside of 14 days, let's say he wants to travel in 16 days, you work the booking regularly in VAX. The Evo agent will still get full commission. And again, I have to repeat that, the Evo agent gets uh, full commission. Okay, let's go to the next one. All right, so now, that was for VAX, okay? For everything else, which is like Cruises, Expedia Tap, Agent Universe, your client visits your evotravelagent.com website, okay? He goes to your website, your evotravelagent.com forward slash whatever it is, and below the fare grabber, all right, in yellow is, is the tab for the credit card information, all right? You just let your client click on that, he fills out the information, he hits submit, okay? All right, so now let's go to the next slide. Oh, here we have a travel alert. This is kind of funny. <laughs> uh, Jill Langley and I got this uh, from an Evo agent um, on April 9th. This email popped up in my inbox on Saturday. I just saw it and it felt as, as a red flag. Can you explain to me why this maybe is a red flag or credit card fraud? It appeared that way as I have no idea who this is. Can you please again explain why using the credit card authorization form will help alleviate these issues with credit card payments? Yes, we will. The next slide, please. And here is the email that we got. Hello, I would like to request a quote for a trip from London to Freetown, departing 10th of April and returning 10th of May 2019, including two night hotel accommodations in Freetown, first two nights. A uh, flag should be on the cheapest airline available on economy class. Kindly forward your finding, i.e. itineraries and fares, to me as soon as possible and advise, advise the type of credit card your company accepts for payment. I look forward to your reply. Kindest regards, Laura Lynch. Hmm, doesn't that email sound familiar? Hmm, let's go to the next slide, please. What? Oh, yes, it does, because this is the same travel alert that we got last week. So, again, please, Upline, New Agents, Nina, Gerald Ford, Patrice Abel Vance, you know, you leaders, this is going out a lot. So let your new agents be aware of this type of warning, okay? This is the, the fraud alert that we got last week. And look, it's, the same, it's the same email, just a different person. I would like to re request a quote for a trip from London to Freetown, to Partington, dot, 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 dot. Kindly forward your findings, i.e. itineraries and fares to me as soon as possible. It, it, you know, kindest regards, Karen Biondo. Okay, so and how do we fight against that? How do we fight against that? Let's go to the next slide. Boom, we use the Evolution Travel Agent Defense. Basically, oh, that's great, you know, email them back or going, because if you try to email them and they say, you know, why don't you call me? They go, oh, no, I can't call you because well, I'm, I'm always busy working. Okay, well, that's great, Mr. and Mrs. Client. Why don't you, you know, before we proceed with the booking, please fill out the credit card authorization form and email the copy of the credit card and your driver's license. You will not hear from them again. Believe me, you will not. You will not. So that's the whole pow and, and kick thing. All right, so now we're going to go to... Preparing your client. Oh, oh. What? Okay, I'm going to look over here now. Oh, okay, can we go to the next slide? Right, now we're going to go to preparing your clients for travel. We got a couple of these, and, and we're going to probably going to run through them the next, uh, you know, during the summer season because th these are important facts that you should really, you know, share with your clients. And, and this is important because, again, this is how you build trust with your client. This is how you build value in your business because you have this knowledge to give to your client. And then they go, wow, that's great. Let's go to the next slide. Okay, the travel agent three steps. One is the pre-travel, right? Where you qualify them, you research it, you follow up, you give them a quote, then you purchase it in the booking and you follow up going, okay, we got it. Now we prep the client for travel. Number two is the travel, whether it's cruise or all-inclusive or you know a tour around Europe or whatever. Number three is the post-travel. You always want to do a follow-up after two weeks after they've been back going, oh yeah, how was your trip? All right, next slide. Okay, agent prep checklist. Number one, passports, personal documents. Had a call this week. People were going, uh, flying out of Cleveland to Miami, um, and they're upset. 
Why? Because their travel agent didn't tell them to, that they needed a passport or a birth certificate to go on a carnival cruise out of my And I'm like, what, what, what? Spoke to the agent, and what happened was the agent was correct. He had an orientation with his 30, 45 people, but the other people never showed up. They were like, no, we don't need to go to that. Okay, but the agent, you as the agent, you really have to make sure that you have, your, your clients have this information. But let me tell you something. This is, this is client nightmare. I've had this, I've heard this from so many agents where they go, oh yeah, my client said they had the, you know, the passport and everything. Yep, it was down there. Yep, yep, yep. And they're like, no, no, I, I, I've got it. I, I know I have validity on the passport. They're driving down to the, to the cruise port or something. And you know what? They get there and the passport's expired. Boom. You know, there goes vacation out the window. So really check that. Make sure, you know, get a copy of that. Travel documents from you. If you have, um, if you're booking them on a tour and you have travel documents, make sure you get them to your clients. You know, we have a lot that come in here that I'm like, oh, we never get calls on people. You know, you got to get the, these documents. If they're buying a Trafalgar tour or if they're going to Africa and they're, you know, they're going on these great, you know, um, Asian Vistas group tour, there's travel documents. You got to get them to them. So make sure they have it. All right. All right. Let's go to the next one. How to pack for a trip. Europe, cruise, all-inclusive internet. You can find all this information online. You can. Just, you know, do a search. How to pack for a trip. And they'll go, what do you want? Europe, cruise, all-inclusive. You can find that. Share that information with your clients. Share that. Uh, agent website, resources. Okay. Uh, in the Evolution Travel Cafe, you have a ton of resources about TSA and passports and travel alerts. Go there. Check that out. If you've got people going to Punta Cana, you know, in, in uh, um the Dominican Republic, check it out because sometimes there are hot spots. You know, be aware of what's going on in the world. You, you're pushing that. You're, you know, and the world's a pretty cool place, but you got to know if there's hot spots in it. And you got to let them know about it. All right, let's go to the next one. Agent prep, the client checklist. Okay, I'm really keen on this program because this is a free program. It's called the Smart Traveler Enrollment Program. And a lot of you guys have known me. You're like, oh, Jose, you're a record. You, you mention this every seven months. But it's a free thing. You register with the STEP program, and it's there's the link, uh, step.state.gov slash step slash. Um, what this is is, is that it, you, you, you register with them, you give them the itinerary, and let's say that you're in Paris, okay? Uh, let's say something happens. There's an international event, or is there a, a, you know, a weather event or something. They text you and tell you where to go. They will either text you to go to the, the nearest hotel or the American embassy or American consulate for your safety. So it's a pretty great, I, I love that program. It's really cool. And it's free. All right, what to expect at the airport? You know, a lot of people don't, you know, they don't know since we've had the new rules since 9-11. Yeah, you need to be there three hours for your international flight, two hours for domestic flight. And during the summertime, it's more crowded, especially if you're going to the big, you know, vacation destinations. Europe, it can take you hours to get out of Charles de Gaulle Airport. If you arrive there, you got to go through passport, you got to go through customs, you got to pick up bag. I mean, it's, it's a whole thing. It's, it, so let them be aware of what they're going to go through. That way they'll, 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 they'll be prepared for it. All right, let's go. Let's go. Oh, my God. Advise and contact the bank. Okay, this is something, we talked about this like when you purchase in the booking. Sometimes the client may not, may only have a limit on the debit card or credit card, like $200, because they're not usually, you know, buying $4,000 worth of merchandise in one day, so they have to raise the limit. Again, here, if you got a client that didn't contact their bank and they're in Paris and they're walking around going, oh, wait, I need $100, wait, or I need 100, you know, euros, and he puts his card in the ATM, guess what? He ain't going to get that ATM card back. Why? Because the computer's reading, whoa, Jose from, you know, L.A. is now in Paris. What? No. -uh. So they'll eat up the card. So it's real easy. Just contact your bank or credit card company. Let them know, I'm going to be out of the country. I'm going to be two weeks and da-da-da. And they know that, okay? Also contact your cell phone provider. Next slide. Okay, so clients pre-checklist for travel. Make sure they have all the travel documents for them to go on the trip. Make sure they have all the personal documents ready and prepared to go handy for travel access. What I mean by this is when they're in the TSA line, you don't want them getting up to the thing and they go, oh, wait, I got to look through my passport. I, wait, where is it? And it clogs up the line. Make sure that they have everything, you know, formalized and then like, boom, here it is. Thank you. Thank you. Move on. Okay. 
Uh, make sure to make copies and have computer backup of all travel and personal documents for your client. You should have copies of his passport, you know, the credit cards, your driver's license, all that stuff. Wear proper clothing for flying. You know, know the baggage information requirements. There's nothing worse than your client coming back going, oh man, you didn't tell me I had to, you know, I got charged $85 for the second bag. Why? Because you didn't tell them. Tell them that. They need to know that. Precede assignment. You should be working that, coordinating that with the airport and your client. The airport times are three to two hours at most. So there you go. You're preparing the client for travel. And is that the, oh, and what's the last one? Oh, I got three more? Oh, no. What's the next one? Uh, oh, yeah. Prep the client. Set up a plan for your client to contact you via email or text uh, on the trip just to make sure everything's okay. You know, when you get to your Paris, you know, just either send me a text or an email. That'd be great. And you should set up for gifts, you know, bottles of wine or cookies or something for your client to arrive to, you, to, to their destiny. They're going to love you for that. What if something happens? Make sure the client can contact you, your cell phone. This is really important. I don't know why this company, I, we get messages all the time in here. We call back, the mailbox is full. The mailbox isn't set up. This is your business. If I'm trying to reach out to you as a travel agent and I find that your email is not, I can't get in contact with you, I'm not gonna call you. I'm not gonna call you. And this is why. You need to be ready. I'm sorry, but you're in the travel industry now. If, if you get a call at three o'clock in the morning, from your client in Europe and he's having an issue there, you've got to be on top of it. Now, when that happens, in case of emergency, call the following. You either call like Funjet or the supplier or Expedia or the cruise line. My client has an issue. What's going on? I need to know if you're having an issue there. And here's something else. I tell you guys all this all the time. When you talk to a cruise line, a supplier or anybody else that you're dealing with, get down their name. I spoke to Bill at Expedia, he told me to do this, ba 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 that way you have backup. And we can go then to the mediums going, well, hey, Bill at Expedia said this, or, or John at Carnival told, us, told the agent to do this, and, okay? So make sure you do that. After that, if you're still having issues, contact Dr. Travel, all right? And have fun and travel around the world. All right. All right, I think that's it, so now let's go to a couple of questions. Questions, 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 right? Your YouTube, Your commercials. Oh, oh, that's right. Oh, yeah, we need to do a commercial. Let's do a commercial. Joseph, is it tracking? Um, <laughs> so yeah, here it is, the European train. We rolled this last week, and, and the thing is, um, we rolled it last week, and it didn't track the audio, and I wanted you guys to hear this. Go ahead. There are so many reasons to travel by train. So hopefully What's you should yours? be hearing this. Do you love that it's easy? Regular connections, products easy, with the flexibility you need. This a is route into the heart um, of Europe's most beautiful they're cities. A great company, they're a, a is it the comfort? Broker. Room to move? Um, space for luggage? States, a chance to enjoy Europe good food? Perhaps it's the landscape, the views, the access, the knowledge your journey really is greener. Um, All this at a price that fits know, any budget. It. Whatever your reason, the train will give you a unique experience. Begin your journey with Rail Europe. Inspiring to connections. Discover Europe from the window of a train. Real Europe. Inspiring connections. If you want some more information, give me a call and I'll show you how to get in, uh, involved with them. And now, let's go to a video. Here we're going to go. I know we were going to go to the Caribbean, but today we're going to go up to Alaska. Yeah, go ahead and mute me. As one of the world's most exhilarating natural wonders, Alaska has so much to offer. Expansive landscapes, iconic wildlife, and intriguing native cultures. So when you book a celebrity cruises vacation to Alaska, be sure you experience the best of both land and sea. A celebrity cruise will take you to some of the most extraordinary stops along Alaska's Inside Passage. On your cruise, you'll experience updated luxury at every turn while taking in the best of coastal Alaska. You'll see glaciers flowing into the sea, forests rising up from the shoreline, and bald eagles soaring gracefully overhead. And as breathtaking as the cruise along the southeastern coastline is, 
there's so much more of Alaska just waiting to be discovered. At least once a tour, I turned to my group and I said, I'd like to welcome you all to my office. This is where I work and I'm glad you're here with me and that I can share Alaska with you. Travelers who want the best of Alaska book a Celebrity Cruises cruise tour, which offers an exhilarating cruise and a multi-night fully escorted land tour. On a celebrity cruise tour, the land portion of your adventure will immerse you in the unspoiled wilderness of Alaska's interior. Driver and tour director will really be their concierge, their historian. They're going to be their friend. They're going to make sure that everything goes smoothly for those guests. You'll experience the must-see destinations, as well as some local favorites your tour director will point out along the way. Destinations include Denali National Park, Seward, Fairbanks, Talkeetna, Girtwood, or Anchorage. Be amazed by North America's highest peak, Mount McKinley. Get stunning photos of caribou, rare birds, and doll sheep. Go fishing in waters rich with salmon. Experience the famed midnight sun. And at every stop, you'll stay in authentic lodges and dine on the best local cuisine. Get the full Alaska experience with a coastline cruise, as well as travel deep into Alaska's rugged wilderness with a Celebrity Cruises cruise tour. Because Celebrity Cruises believes that every moment of your vacation should be measured by just how far it takes you from the ordinary. That's modern luxury. That's Celebrity Cruises. All right, huh? Celebrity Cruises. Those are the, the cruise tours for Alaska. Alaska's a great, you know, uh, destination. It sells out. If you're doing land there, you got to be an, a year in advance to just to do land hotels because there's only so much inventory. The cruises sell out. If you got people that want to go to Alaska this summer, they got to book now. Um, I know we don't do a lot of that, but they, it's a wonderful, wonderful destination. So, and there's a lot of great experiences to go there. You have the Nali National Park. You've got the you know the icebergs and everything it's really fun and I wanted to show that to you because we don't book a lot of celebrity and we should be looking at other cruise lines and, and bringing that up all right with that being said let's do some a uh, couple of questions and answers and then I got to go okay so let's see here um, I can't see it in this box what okay yeah the PowerPoint's still up all right so just hold on here We'll do a question. Yep, I see it now. All right, so hold on. So we've been doing a lot, and thank you for being uh, a little bit patient with us. We're going to be doing a lot more. We're going to be doing a lot more interviews, a lot more videos for you guys. Okay, when did the ele okay, Latasha? When did the electronic credit card authorization become effective? I have some paper credit card authorizations that were completed in February, March, and the end of last year. Do I need to send them? No, Latasha, you don't. You just hold on to those just from now on. Like I said, anything that's not marked travel, you're going to do it uh, on your travel site, like, you know, Expedia and the cruises and Agent Universe, okay? All right, so let's see what else we got here. Cindy, I want to go to Alaska. I have a friend who lives there, <laughs> okay? Oh, Rosemary Valario, uh, Valaro, hi, Jose, a Puerto Rican travel agent in Seattle, which I just want to say um, it looks like Puerto Rico will be opening up, I think it's this week or next week, uh, according to Ron. So, you know, welcome Puerto Rican agents. I guess we're going to have to start doing this in Espanol, okay? Oh, that's great. Um, do, do we have to complete a vendor request for all suppliers? Jasmine, no. Just follow Congratulations New Evolution Agent um, in your PTA training link. Go through that. Becca, hi, Joe. It's Becca from Texas. Well, hi, Becca. All right. Zambia, Jose, I'm not nagging you this way. <laughs> Jose, I'm not nagging you this. Well, thank you, Zambia. I'm glad we got the contracts all signed. <laughs> Latasha, thanks, Jose. All right, let's see what else we got here. Um, where's Michael Clark? He, has, he's, he hasn't said anything about my plane. Mm -hmm. Denise Doe, I have a client going to Alaska June 20, June 21 on, um, okay, where is that? Where is that? Okay, way to go, Denise, on Celebrity Cruise. Good for you. They're going to have a really good time. All right, let's see, awesome. Latasha, Fi family has been on both, oh, Donna. Okay, we got some people who have been on Alaska cruises. They loved it. 
Uh, very helpful information. Josie, uh, who's doing this? Aretha Wilkerson. I'm doing an Alaskan cruise soon. Good for you, Aretha. That's really cool. All right. My <laughs> There's Michael Clark. I need this video in my life. <laughs> I'm glad, Michael, you didn't ask for the plane yet. There, there's the plane. Uh, rail and sea. Amazing. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, Latasha, I have credit card authorization. Okay, and they're very helpful. Copy center and then call it fax. Okay, Dion, D Donna, working on a train trip right now. Donna F F uh, F Ferio, call me on that, would you? I'd like to help you and assist you with that if you're doing the real Europe on a train thing. Marcy, I meant to send it to Archer. I sent my clients a self-addressed stamp. Okay, call me on that, Marcy. Okay, and let's see if I got any more. And then what we'll do is we'll, okay. <laughs> Dion. <laughs> uh, Becca, Becca Perez, I wanna become a Disney travel agent. How do I go about doing that? And do I need to connect with all the suppliers once I'm certified? Well, yes you do, but Becca, what you wanna do is you wanna visit DisneyTravelAgents.com. That's DisneyTravelAgents.com. And Becca, you don't need to sign up with all the, uh, all the suppliers. We would want you to be signed up with the five Archer Travel resources which are in your PTA training program when you go. Congratulations New Evolution Agent where you register with Agent Universe, Expedia Tap, um, Vax Vacation Access, Go CCL, Royal Caribbean. We want you to master those first because what we've, what we've noticed since we started this program is we had agents that were just, oh I got to be registered with everybody you know and wasn't holiday da, 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 da. and it was like they're on a buffet line with two, two trays and they're just loading them up. They sit down, they don't know where to start. So really master Asian Universe, master Expedia Tap, master Vax Vacation Access. Know where the deals are. There's several webinars in this page that show you where the deals are in Vax. Know that, that's gonna help you become a better agent. Okay, one more and then I'm gonna go. Great info, thank you. Uh, we'll do, okay, yeah, they're going to Canada. Okay, Donna, via, via, that's uh, in Canada, it's called Via Rail is the company that works Canadian uh, trains. So I will help you with that. Um, Regina says, hi, Jose. Okay, what vendor do I use for Nigeria, Africa? We don't have uh, a vendors. We have vendors that do safaris, but for Nigeria, their best bet is to book that through like Expedia Tap, book the air and the land and the car and all that there. Call me if you need help on that. Okay, Dion, call me. Um, Thank you for helping uh, Louisa Howard. I resubmitted my commission form yesterday, received my email this morning. See you there? All right, I'm, uh, thank you, Louisa Howard. Amy, okay, I had a person from Canada that wanted to be an agent. Are we ever going to be able to bring them on as agents? Last Monday, Ron really spoke about Canada, and Canada is not a good place for us to recruit. So again, Upline, I really need your help here, and especially you mature agents that have been here. Ron made a big thing about that. We could really get into a lot of trouble with the Canadian government. They don't like working with MLMs. So do not try to register Canadian agents. Do not, okay, until we get it okay from Joe Langley and Ron, but this was brought up. So go back and review what Ron said on Monday. Okay, look in the Travel Cafe. All right, and one more, thank you. Cindy Chavez, thank you so much. I'm gonna share this video with some fellow people. Thank you. All right, everybody, that's it for this week. Um, join us next week. Uh, we're going to have some more surprises, some more videos, and, and every, everything else. Have a great time. Call me if you need anything. I'll see you around.